Uh, two of the top teams in the nation, and two of the top teams in Hockey East go head to head tonight on a Hockey East Friday night. We're taking it to a game at Serena here in Boston on the campus of Boston University, where the second ranked uh, BU Terriers play host to the 12th ranked. 11th ranked New Hampshire Wildcats, depending which poll you look at. Friday up at Merrimack, passing out of front, good cycle there, nice save by Foster, rebound out in front, and the rebound, score! Colin Wilson in the first minute of play, and the Terriers make a statement with a 1-0 lead. Very aggressive forecheck, very good work behind the net, and Wilson with the beautiful finish. Just 38 seconds. They won the faceoff, went in the offensive zone, and never left. They get that first goal of the game. Wilson getting his eighth of the season. Tremendous forecheck. Tremendous forecheck and energy right there. The junior out of Saskatoon sends it in. NBU gets control now. Shot to the left side. Score! Corey Trevino took the shot. And just like that, the Terriers have a 2 0 lead. Tremendous forecheck pre pressure again. They're all over the Wildcats in their own end. That time Foster got a bad break on, on that one. I think there was a deflection in front that threw it off. But it, right now they got them totally on their heels and they're out, out hustling them, out checking them, out moving. You see the battle on the boards, then the turnover. Shot right there, we'll see if... Welcome back, BU up to nothing on the Wildcats. Here we go right here, a very lazy play by the BU defense here. They go into a quick trap, gets a stick in the way. Great goaltending save there by Karen Milan. Johnny on the spot there being awake on that big turnover. Power play here, quick puck movement, one-timer. And the key to that one-timer is he hit the net. I'm British Columbia. Here's Higgins trying to go wide on the left side around Kim. Daniels there, sets it front. Lawrence scores! Just like that, Jason Lawrence makes it three to nothing. Boston University on his 11th goal of the season. Tremendous play. This is all hard work. All hard work here. Driving wide, driving the net, clearing out that space. And Lawrence filling that hole. Tremendous play. Perfect execution of a three on two, a quick three on two there. I mean, you would think it would, sometimes you would think it's a laying, laying an egg, having a bad night. But in reality, Providence played terrific and they, and they built off it. In our, our Sliding through to the left side. One more pass broken up. Van Riemsdyk breaking out short handed. James Van Riemsdyk will curl and drag over the doorstep. Trying to go upstairs and Milan just got a piece of it and it's an offside call here you go one of the most talented kids in the country and he shows it there we'd like to say hello on that move uh, just a perfect curl and dragon shot big save by Milan wait but no one in front of the net to Try distract him at all Try to change that now Butler off the two on one maybe that just extra second before he got the shot away Gave uh, Milan a chance to recover. Looks like they caught him on a change, which they did. Tremendous up ice pass there. Great shot, but Milan very steady, got over to that. This is their fourth power play of the night. Here's a chance LeBlanc goes to the front, and a great save there. Best of the night for Milan as Collins had him point blank. A little laziness there by the BU defense. Causes that turnover. And a bad bounce. Great play out front on the backhand. Another steady, steady save. Like Got it now. De Simone looking the high slot. His bid was blocked there. The puck comes out to neutralize. First penalty comes to an end. Tremendous play. And Lawrence with a steal here into the offensive zone. He cuts back. Short-handed shot. Oh, what a save there. And that would have been a crushing turn of events for the University of New Hampshire. Great penalty killing there leading to that. But the Boston University's defenseman Sean Kirk staying in the shooting lanes there, blocking the shots. It leads to this turnover. Tremendous cutback. Backhand sauce and a tremendous save by Foster. One hopefully to build his confidence. Now, love that time the goalie. Moran was able to bat it up ahead and a three on two developing here for the Terriers. Second of the game for Colin Wilson. 
and a 4 nothing lead for PU. This is where a 3-on-2, when you don't go hard in the net, it works out. Most times it doesn't, but what happens is UNH completely loses his back check there. His stick is free. You back check the stick as well as the man there. He lets the stick go, and it's in the back of the net. Right now, just roll it over. Skating game, neutral ice game. Whoops. And that'll be a penalty on Pereira as he uh, tripped up the Wildcat who's coming in with speed. So it'll be a UNH power play, their seventh of the game after this. Occurred on this call. Now they get it through. Capstad had a shot, glove save. And the follow up save made there as Milan holds on. They had a point blank opportunity with Dries on the rebound. Jared Milan coming up big again. And it's funny, just making it look easy almost. Always in the right position. A shot right down the middle. Let's a rebound up in perfectly squared up position to the rebound shooter. And, and very much makes it look easy. Well, they do, they do what you want to do when you're struggling. To the net, bodies to the net. They're on the doorstep, hacking away. And it's just one of those nights so far. Those games. And as we've been talking about, solidify its hopes for a home ice advantage. And here's Yip, off to the races. Brandon Yip to the backhand, save made, and the rebound went wide. We've got a whistle on the play as Yip had a breakaway opportunity. UNH was able to get back and close the door. The, the defense disappeared looking for a pass, cut him off a little, and, and a tremendous save by Foster. Connolly getting it back up. Cohen fires it down hard. Off the goalie and in. Trevino was trying to pass it across, but he will take his second collegiate goal in a 5-0 lead. Great pass down by Cohen, right to the goal line, trying to go across and gets it off the skate. But this line, TC deserved it. They've been a tough, great line all night tonight, working very hard. Corey Trevino and his mates have played excellent. I think Jackie gave him some power play time because of their excellent play, and he, and he cashes it in. With the whistle, we had a little uh, extracurricular here as Colin Wilson went over a little how do you do against Greg Collins. This is college, not the NHL, so we'll see how this is sorted out. Well, we knew it was coming, TC. I mean, uh, the way the game's gone, it's been very quiet, but with the game tomorrow night, this you knew it would carry over, and you were... Close out the shutout.